Hello and welcome everyone to another Let's Play with the Developers. My name is Ray Comes and I'm one of the main developers of Mind Colonies. And we are here on Forgecraft. Or today it's more like Lagcraft. And hoping that things uh, settle down a little bit. Um, hi Superminix, hi Jeremy, how are you guys doing? We are having around 3 TPS on the server. The ping is not great either. <laughs> it's it's all a lot of fun. <laughs> uh, tough life today. Um, doing fine, doing fine. Been uh, all day long all day long following uh, li life election results <laughs> like a li little maniac and I'm not even American meanwhile Any new buildings coming soon? Good question. At the moment, we're more working on consolidation. But after that is finished, we're probably going to be getting some new buildings in the future again as another explorer and these kinds of things we've talked about a few times already. Hi, Chef. Thanks a lot for the six subscription. Highly appreciate it. So, yeah, we are having some serious issues on the server. Let's see again. How much TPS? 2.4 TPS. Amazing. Just takes a minute to eat. <laughs> we can do this. We, get, we can get through this. Let me see if there's any admin around. Ah, uh, well. Um. Endless meal, yes. We're going to end, eat, and eat on this potato and chew on it. Must be a very chewy to potato indeed. Lord, is this a chewy potato? Apparently it was having quite some lag issues for most of the day today. You're going to trying to get the population of a thousand? That's going to be quite a challenge, I believe. I'm going to be starved before eating this potato. <laughs> I also fear so. I heavily fear so. I heavily fear so too. Come on potato. You can do this. Eventually we're going to eat this potato. Meanwhile hoping an admin is going to come around. To restart the server. So So the things are breaking at least somewhat. <laughs> nice. That's going to be a challenge, and especially the raids are going to be a challenge for you at those high population settings. If you only reach like 250, 350 population on our competition server, and it got quite competitive already, let's say it like this. Uh, 
man. He's gonna try to crash the servers. Did anyone watch Sorin these days to see how how to crash the server? <laughs> Lord, this is horrible. This 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 is literally worse than watching the election results slowly trickle in. <laughs> This is more teeth grinding than watching the election results trickling in. What are we still? TPS? 2.0? It's getting worse? Come on, potato. Potato, potato. You gotta do this. You gotta eat. Yeah, I'm feeling like... Oh, we, we got one log done. Can you see this? A huge déjà vu. I already seen those. Okay. Okay, the server stopped. <laughs> Not sure if we crashed it because the TPS fell too low. Okay, that, that means it's going to get better. Stack overflow error. You gotta just wait a second for the server to start up. Hmm, now we just gotta wait a second or so. But uh, now we crashed it. <laughs> I wonder if it got shut down and restarted. Apparently there's been a bunch of Discord connection problems today. Like the Discord mod was causing issues. But okay, the server is starting up, and then we can start doing our regular stuff. Yeah, okay, we can log in. Hi, John, how are you doing? I'm not yet Dr. Ray. Uh, future Dr. Ray. Future Dr. Ray is doing fine. Been doing some experiments today and then binge watching election results for most of the day. Okay, um. Let's hope that this is loading. Okay, now now the TPS should be fine. Do you see this? The tree is 
Are you kidding me? We started the server just a second go ago. And we are already... But let me eat first, quickly. Ah, player came. So he did the shutdown. Okay, amazing. Hi, Merlin the Skeleton. Hi, Ingerton. That's been a while, truly. How are you doing? How have you been? Also, anxiously looking at the US election result as the rest of the world. <laughs> so, I'm going to replan some of these here, meanwhile. And then we gotta take another nap. Yeah, university stuff. I know how that is, I'm doing that all the time as well. <laughs> it is, I think there's probably a, a number there together as well. It's It's definitely one... It's definitely the default one in many games. We are out of potato, potatoes. Um, we should have some... Not yet. For the TPS now. 14.8. Not, not great for two players, 14 TPS. Let's get some water. Uh, we can greatly look at our amazing waterfall we worked on in the last episode. So, a stack of potatoes. Hi Margo, how are you been? And look at what we've been working on the last episode, is getting this builder running here. So what is your problem? You need a shovel and you're hungry. That looks like a bad mix. Okay, got you the shovel. And the hungry situation is going to be resolved here. I think it's quite a nice position for the builder though. Going to allow us a lot on this part of the map. And the other builder is then for the other part of the map responsible. Um, and we wanted to do the work down here and get some more spruce logs. Your stream is laggy. I should be fine. I can close a few things. We got a lot of things open. I can close that too. Okay. Um, nether colonies are enabled. If you enable multi-dimensional colonies in the config file. However, now that's the however. Colonists do not travel through portals. They just don't. I'm going to be getting some oak logs. Um, oak logs, stairs and fence and stuff. I'm going to get some more oak. Oak and spruce we wanted to get here. Are you complaining about something? Or you're just waiting? I guess just waiting. Okay, let's get some of these here. Okay. I think he's waiting for the all the trees he's been working on to, to grow back. Okay. So, just started. He's working on this citizen one over there. Oak plank, stairs, fence gate and stuff. So, first planks, do we have enough? We don't. Still more planks. The stairs a lot. There was one of these. So, this. Bunch of the stairs. We still need a lot more stairs. Old planks, a bunch of fence gate, fen normal fences as well. So it was 13. If I'm not mistaken. Yes. 
so. And only stairs are now missing. Um, gunpowder. Let me check. Let me first make some more of those stairs. Then I'm going to check for a shy uh, for gunpowder. So let's drop up some more of the stairs. Fine for a, a while at least, and then we check if we have some gunpowder lying around. I definitely don't need my gunpowder. That is for sure. What do I have? Twelve. I got like 16. Does that help? I tried to refresh the stream. Doesn't it help? I think you. But yeah, the stream should be fine on my side at least. Except... I'm going to have to turn on in the colony so that pe neutral people can pick up, pick up stuff. There was this here. Asha, I already got her as friend. Did I... Turn on all the things in the friend tab. On, 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 on. Oh, I shouldn't attack. There's another one I shouldn't have turned on, isn't there? Fight guards. Sorry. Okay. Here. There. Okay, now we gotta go back and put all those cruise logs into place. A TNT? I don't know. Okay, I wanted at least any way to set up this stuff. So it is on this here, and we do have to go up quickly and craft some of these here first. Because we need more of the slabs to do that. Is there anything else this builder needs, by the way, while we are around? More oak fans and more oak stairs. I have a little bit... I think I can help a little bit with that. Some fans and some stairs at least. I'm going to help to finish. We're going to... Okay, enough. it's enough fans at least. To get him quite far. So, then one, two, three, here, gotta fill in the upper area here as well, and then we go over step by step here, and do this, one, two, three, one, two, three, and then I'm going to do that for all the areas, one, two, three. Now we actually are going to go around the corner as well. We got a 1-2 gap here. And then we got continued with the 1-2-3 thing. 1-2-3. Uh, Do we need this on the last corner here as well? I guess it doesn't hurt. And put the a little bit lower. One, two, three. Great. Now I just gotta fill in on the top. But those don't connect. Ah! 
anywhere. I just wanted to say that because then I can main what main my vein mine them away. What a difficult word. Awesome. <laughs> really glad that it's fine now. So here we go. There we go. There's no dirt connection anywhere. Yay! Okay. Done. So this here has to be connected. This here has to be cut. And those here have to be filled in the remaining platform here. So there we go. Here we go. Done. Awesome. And then we gotta make a lot of that spruce fence. So spruce logs to make spruce fences here, so we can make this here. Uh, secure platform ah no okay done around the corner until here finish now yeah and I got a raid in the southeast so southeast for me is this direction. So that's the not the place I'm in. So southeast is this direction here. Got a sword. Gotta sleep a little bit longer. Secure for Ray. <laughs> Should be safe for the colonists as well. They're not as bad as they used to be with this kind of stuff. Southeast. It should be somewhere around here. That's the east side. And we are in the south. I can't see any fires around. I'm a little bit concerned. I'll just break all of these here again. Made my vision a little bit blurry. I do have some arrows too. Yeah, that's not a lot. Okay. I wonder from where they're going to come. Southeast, it says. I'm seeing there very far away a red dot. But very far away. And down there. And it's coming closer. There it is. Down there. these nasties there they are doing nasty fun stuff one done second done defended they could have never never done that oh there's a baby enderman that was the other red dot that was an easy defend. <laughs> Huge raid, yeah. Enormous. Enormous raid. Very dangerous. I really wonder what she's up to with all that bad rock stuff. Oh, this one seems sick again. Aren't ya? Carrot and potato. Sick again. 
That's why my my fields are not taken care of. So uh, if the TP has moved so low. I think the TP has moved so low that it hit the absolute limit for the server to crash. Yeah, just two. We have a very small colony with very low level housing, so that is to expect to be expected. Like people are saying like I'm going to wait for a while to build my colony because I'm going to get raider. It's not worth it because these early raids are so easy to deal with that it's much more worth it to actually get those raids and just kill them easily and then preventing raids for very long periods of times. I got some oak logs out of that. I think I picked up a little bit too much of that spruce. We dump a few of these, merge them together, and we're going to get the remaining um, stairs to our respective builders. Let's go. Um, Mr. One, 40 stairs. That's at least 40 stairs, I guess. So here. Oh, it's actually 40. Exactly. Perfect. Nothing to complain about. So we go to I said Horizon. How are you doing? And we go to our other builder and bring him the remaining stairs he needs. What is your name, mister? I'm going to call you both Bob if I can't remember your names. It's Curtis and this one here is Philip. Okay, Philip. I have barely 36. That's not exactly all you need. But I think it's a good start. While we run back there, mine a little bit more oak. And then get started. Doo -doo -doo. And we see what we're going to do with our builders. And oak, oak, oak. Should replant some of these probably. Because having a little bit of a supply for oak here, this part of the colony, I think does uh, make some decent sense. Okay, I think that's fine. And for tier 2. Um, and we go to our lumberjack. Oh, there's another oak tree here. I haven't seen. Maybe just enough for the remaining oak. I know I'm a bit lazy, but that should be just enough. Let's run there. Okay, there we go. And our research finished! Awesome! So we can already look into the next research we're going to do. But first we, we make our builder happy. First priority. And welcome Mount Mr. Mount Och. That's a difficult one to pronounce. Please correct me if I mispronounce it by a thousand percent. She's, she's up to something. Shy is up to something. It's been exploding bedrock. Yeah, Jay is not available yet. I I do know that. Um, I was also kind of surprised by that when I looked into it. M T M Tor. Okay, M Tor. I'm glad you're enjoying Mine Colonies. Uh, we're actually the developers of Mine Colonies streaming here. At the moment, it's me, but we often stream. Uh, two three developers together here at the moment we are on forgecraft so it's only me um so we got that one builder up there we can already look into the next upgrades 
Okay, the builder level 1 was finished. We're going to probably already go with the builder to level 2. That one is finishing the citizen hats. Let's check if we started our uh, career upgrades and what does our lumberjack need? Another hoe? That I can give you. Give you a hoe and an axe. Hoe and axe. And then we look upon... Wait, I made a new path. No, wait, that's better. Better over here, that's quicker. And we can check then on our two career huts we set up in the last episode. And can see if that... If we can set up some nice alternative paths around here. Can set up if that works. I think we got another path. Don't we have another path over there as well? A little bit confused right now. I thought I had set up one, but I might be also completely mistaken. So I had set up one here. Okay, I had clicked to build on it. I expect my builder to... Yes. I can build through a few nights too though, not a problem. I need to set up here a few. The career should be fine. Okay, the builder here is already coming up. Wondered, I didn't have no I didn't have an additional one over that corner. I think I I thought I did, but that's one that's one that's the one here. Okay. So we go down here. All the way back. Yeah, it's quite the, the quite the ways we've built for ourselves. Why is he running around? We should prob we should quite certainly get ourselves some waystone set up nicely and take care of that. Then, oh, I wanted to check on the research. Almost forgot about that. Um, there we go. Down we go. Yeah, we do have uh, IE in the in the pack, but we also have waystones. I probably should just distribute a few waystones all over the place. We don't have that. Mm, eight rotten flesh, at bone, and eight spider eggs. Maybe we have that. Eight, eight, eight. That sh that should we should have that for the night taunt research. So, there we go, um, two spider eggs, no spider eggs, one spider egg, but definitely not the eight I was looking for, and I don't have, yeah, I don't have any of the stuff for it, that's disappointing. Let me check on the other researches then. Yeah, riding seed cable down the mountain is quite nice. I would set up here and there one for that. For that sake. That could be neat. That I that I get on board with. Yeah, I can check my guards too, that's true. But they haven't I think they didn't have a lot of stuff to fight. But I might be mistaken. So I can't do this, I can't do that, can't do that, can't do that, can't do this. So, what we can do here, we don't have a level 3 citizen, we don't have a level 1 town hall, and we can unlock this here, so let's get the 3 books, because we have uh, the 
combined citizen had levels for that. Three books that is. Three boxies. And yeah, we have to get our stuff upgraded in this colony. Having our buildings around level two is a little bad. But we are still setting up our stuff. I first want to have some decent infrastructure going. Um, what was it again? Three. What was the research again? Books. Three books. Wow. Okay. That was quite the memory leak right now. <laughs> Come on, Ray. Down we go. Down the hill. That would be interesting if I could get citizens to slide down those as well. Okay, it was civilian. Okay, I can research both. School or library? Let's start with school. So, that done. I have a skeleton around here. Will do. Yeah, zip lines are neat. But at least set up a zip line from one mountain to the other. <laughs> it would be it would be not so difficult. It would be similar to the uh, the rails thing of citizens. Um but yeah, I'm going to. I'm, what is the the recipe for a waystone? A warp stone, and it needs. Yeah, that's expensive. That needs four ender pearls and an emerald. I don't think I have any ender pearls. No ender pearls here. Ender. I don't have any ender pearls. Parachutes or gliders. Yeah, there's so many options. Okay. Now the next part. I'm going to stay online during. We're going to keep this night uh, once so she can hunt around the stuff she needs. Yeah, I know. I do know Waystone spawn in the wild, but I haven't seen any so far. Not been very lucky with that. to help her on some creepers hey there was some cross miss shooting in the wrong direction I got one gun gunpowder out of this, really. One only. Kinda disappointing. But it, we did say we need ender pearls. I'm going to try a sneak attack. Oh, there's a skelly. Wow, Ender Per. Are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? What the hell is up with this, with this Enderman on steroids? What the hell was this? Can anyone explain this to me? I had full diamond basically, and he just four hit me. And the official pack is also going to have waystones, and I just lost 24 levels. 
10 hits. I'm just slow. It felt like four of them. Yours is teleporting too fast around me. I still had decent gear. No, we don't have any champions here. At least some arrows. And the mark of shame on the mark. My death. Now there's no champions in this pack. That was still uh, heavily aggressive. But Endermen are my favorite not enemy I try to avoid if possible. But it was that one was still pretty strong, unexpectedly I have to say. These days I fought another one that was also bad. And the other ones are just yeah, I heard that. You can throw a boat there and it just spawned in the boat. Oh, it's getting day already. Nice. As you can already check out on our builder list here. First of all, are you building? No, didn't start the next task yet. Uh, they just climb on the boat and get stuck and don't teleport around anymore. That at least seems somewhat helpful. Okay. We can see what our builder here is up to and can schedule a level 2 upgrade. Oh, there's a spider. We wanted some spider eyes. That's what we wanted, right? One more spider eye. Awesome. Oh, that one here started on the delivery man level 1. That is a little bit far for you, don't you think? I'm going to fire him. I'm going to hope the it still has that here assigned to him. Darn. So I'm going to go there. I'm going to call him. So I'm going to still hire you. But I'm going to run there. I'm going to assign the other builder to this delivery hut. Because he's just way, way too far away from this career. Come on. That builder is already far enough away. What happened there? Did I manually assign it to the wrong builder hut? Don't tell me that. Let's go up. Uh, I a canceling, I still have to walk there and restart it anyway, right? So, let's see. No. Also sick, carrot and potato. Both are sick, carrot and potato. And nothing in their huts. Now, I did... I did start both. I did start both careers, but I have to assign both of them to the same builder. Can't have the wrong builder pick up both of them, that is not how this is supposed to go. Okay, that one here is not. I wonder which career this builder is working on then. Because Curtis also just started on the career. Okay. Build. Curtis. Build building. And then we get two of these carrots. Two of these potatoes. We dump the remaining things in our treasure chest. And then we that includes the eye. And then we look if they if he's still assigned to a career. I wonder if I misplaced a career somewhere. It shouldn't. Why is this reading higher, higher? It's 
strange. Yeah, that one here didn't exist when I set that up, exactly. That's why it's confusing me. Okay, now it updated. There was something weird happening. At least some of the things I can already deliver. Needs a bunch of birch stuff, so we're going to bring him all the birch he needs. Uh, so we're going to bring him all the birch he needs. And you know what? I'm going to assign. So I don't have a sawmill yet, unfortunately. We're not so far. So first, we're going to go to the f two guards that are sick, and we're going to solve their situation up there. Then we definitely need a hospital and urgently because I do not feel like spending half of my time curing the citizens. So we do need a hospital. Urgently, that is. I'm going to make sure that this is not the first block in your interview because I yeah, hear hungry too. Okay, that should be fine. So, next step, we go home again. Okay, he started with the delivery man. Then we get a bunch of birch. We get a little bit of dark oak as well. And the remaining things we have, we can get some of those oak fa fences as well. We bring him the stuff. A glass was there as well. I remember that. So we have some glass around here. So Yeah, I need another scroll definitely. I agree, I agree, I know. <laughs> so Four cores dirt, seven oak fence. You have some oak fence with me. So one birch button, one birch plank, and two birch, birch slabs. So one birch button and a set of slabs. But it's button slabs, twenty-five fence. So that is not even close. We need much more of this. We need more sticks. So that's 27. And one birch plank. Which still kind of can be right here. Birch plank, glass, oak fence. So, four cord, one dark oak. So here the dark oak planks. Then spruce stairs, door, and trap door. So spruce stairs. Spruce doors. And a lot of spruce trap doors. Hi Jendo, how are you doing? Welcome to the chat. So, trap doors, doors and stairs. You can just all the residue you get. So it's still some more... Nine more screws, screws that trap doors. The four... Eight... Enough. Um, oh wow, for eight item frames. So, now I'm going to, for now, register this here. I need four cores dirt, 
and a bunch of other things. So let's take care of that now. Yeah, I do have four letters. I think I have just Malcolm, welcome Sardor Percy as well. Welcome to the chat. Um, we do have a head somewhere here. Enough for the four item frames. What happened? Funny. Okay. The item frames. All of these. Or is dirt. So we do need two of these to make the cores dirt. Four. Yeah, I grabbed one, not four. Oak, oak, oak. Racks. Two racks. Fifteen white wool. Fifteen white wool and two rags. Do I have iron with me? The build tool in the middle, wasn't it? Yes. To make four already. Dump this one here. And 20 stone slabs. And a bunch of oak. Um, this you can dump as well. When, wait, this is 20, yeah, 20 stone slabs. I have the stuff for that with me too. One, two, three. One more. And the rest is oak. Yes. So we can cut down a bit more of our forest here. Um, some are being delivered. That means he got the delivery open, but that is assigned to me. That means the necessary ones are available at the lumberjack but it doesn't mean the, there's a courier coming to deliver it that got me quite a bit 52 that's not so bad might it be just enough it's just enough what do we need here perfect as so we can bring him all the remaining materials eat something in between and take the rest of the night to bring the remaining materials to the other builder I have the citizen down here stuck kid so that was this and this Horse dirt, wool, rack, and log. Then oak fence, one gate. Again, one fence. So, one fence gate. A bunch of normal fences. Yeah, that's in a floating island. A tinker's floating island to the east. And you sharp, sharply identified it. Oak slabs. I'm going to make it some more. I'm going to need that for future buildings too. Same for stairs. Slabs. Do you think there's a waystone up there? I wouldn't even think it's unlikely that there is a waystone up there. Now only the stripped oak logs are missing. I know there is a few for pickup at the other builder. I think I'm done with this one here. Whoa, ciao. Okay. So... Then the lumberjack, and at the lumberjack station, some 
strip logs. Five of them. Yes. And we can already look here. We can reassign this to this one here now. And we can already see what we can... A few things we can give up here. Some cobble. So we need two barrels. That's easy. Two barrels. Four, and then a lot of oak stuff. Lots of oak stuff and a bit more cobblestone. We get some more cobblestone and then we cut down some more oak trees. And welcome We The Boy Show. Um, is the mine colony is coming for 116.4? No, mine colony is not coming for 116.4. Mine colony is already arrived for 116.4. <laughs> it doesn't have to come. Oh yeah, the craft benches thing is probably an easy recipe. can plan those. I released a 116.4 on the day of the Rio of 116.4 release of Forge basically quite quite some time ago. Can I pick those like right pick? Um, you have to check in the alphas tab. Ah, CurseForge doesn't support 116.4 yet. But I'm, I'm pretty sure that it works fine. The more... What was this? Oh, a lot more oak logs we need actually. For this here. But we did already upload that. It's just marked as an alpha. That might be the reason why you can't find it. 84, that's not a lot. Yeah, and the latest version for 116.3 uh, works for both 116.3 and 116.4. Exactly. Those are cross compatible. Okay. We got those healed. I was walking down here. Um, what was the next step? We still got a bunch of oak stuff here left. I can bring those strip logs to the other builder quickly. While I'm waiting for my oak trees to regrow. I can cut them down again. Mr. Builder, Mr. Builder. I got some... Some... The rest is going to request, the Lumberjack is going to take care of them. And then I don't have to de do the annoying stripping myself. Already super useful that a Lumberjack does it for me. Um, I think those here already... Are already ripe again to be cut down. Soon we have already pretty decent quantities of sugarcane. I feel like we have to go in the dungeons. Yeah, we should probably go a little bit in the dungeons. To... Okay, let's do... First of all, all of my tools I think have honing available. Let's see what we can do there. Okay, we can do here damage in prison. That one doesn't have, that one doesn't have. As honing available. And f more, s more speed. And that one has an iron butt yet. 
let's get him a new butt. A diamond butt, that is. Um, jewel bud. Craft. Okay. Um, that one also has honing available. But I think nothing, no more space, okay. And welcome David as well to our colony. Okay, let's then dump a few of the things here. Um, and initially we had quite the issues on the competition server with the big colonies. Um, and the delivery man actually, actually not delivering. But later on uh, we were relatively good, we were faring very well having the couriers deliver all the things we needed. Do I want to be a collaboration with you? That sounds like a, a weird formulation. And we don't even know each other. Maybe you should uh, start by introducing yourself. Okay. There we go. Uh, where was the first dungeon? Was it... I think it was in this direction. I hope it was in this direction. I think it was, yes. This looks good. So... Yes. Here's the huge I'm going to get lost dungeon. And I'm going to get some of those rails. That's going to be useful in the future. Definitely. Maybe we're going to find some more mobs in here. Zombies. I'm, I'm out on the hunt for zombies. To be completely exact. Because I want the rotten flesh to make leather. Okay, that's a new area. Up here. Not if I need oak. Yeah, there's a lot of oak down here as well. That's true. <laughs> Oops. I can here. Free oak. It's quite a... Each of these here is quite... Quite nice with oak, right? There we go. Further. Okay. Here, cobweb. String is always useful too. Ah, no. Not water. Hey, at least I watered. Oh, wow. What? What? What is happening? What is happening? Two, two baby skeletons? You're kidding me? Three baby mods in one place. And killed with one hit. That's what I like to see. Um, I think it's that they were used to babysitting and not... Yes. I think people get very easily used to babysitting and then continue just that uh, indefinitely. I, I agree on that sentiment. Yeah, it's free, free oak, wasn't it? We were in need of oak. Okay, we got the first one here coming for us. Come, come. Attract a few of your pr your buddies. I want your flesh. <laughs> I just want you for your. I just want you for your buddy. I, demon.
Come on, nothing is worse than mobs falling down somewhere and starting to hit you. Oh well, had a cave spider spawner. Uh, nothing is worse than cave spiders. I really detest those. Okay, what is coming? What do we have here? Some useful stuff. Some less useful stuff. Uh, so, yeah, the vein mining of the cobwebs is really useful. Overgrown seed. I think the rest is fine. So. Ah, yeah, you just have to make a, a pull request for the names. But that is that should be relatively easy with with text files especially like there's there are things that are relatively like making pull requests for bigger things like adding additional files is difficult but for names that should be relatively easy you, you should um, talk with Raven on our discord she does that all the time She can definitely help you out with that. It's better, definitely good to look around the corners. And, and seeing zombies over there. And skeletons. So... Yeah, it comes. I want you. I want your flesh. Yes, Raven Builder, exactly. Oh, yes, more. Good. I need more of your flesh. Awesome. Eight. It's eight defenses. A little bit lazy on those. Don't have to overdo it. <laughs> what we're getting is already fine. So, get some more of those rails here while we're at it. There we go. What is down here? Just a dead end. Dun, dun, dun. And I think this here looks like an area I already, already visited. Yes. I think I'm going to block this off then. And I think I can probably just block off this entire thing here now. Am I full already on one stack? I am. Okay, eating something. Oh wow, another of those darn baby skeletons. Darn you, all of you. Where's my bow, by the way? Got the creeper. There's a zombie down there. I want that zombie. I want his flesh. Oh, there's another creeper. Oh wow. There was another thing. Ah, this here. Those wraith thingies. Super annoying as well. Hearing everywhere. Uninvitedly, especially.
nice zombies. Just gonna make sure I don't accidentally take them down. Come on, you had to pick up the other zombies flash, right? Oh wow, there's a lot of mobs down here taking each other on. Yeah, yeah, take each other on. Come on, have fun together. I'll pick up the scraps afterwards. Meanwhile, I can look. I have two more torches. You took down the rest, I see. And you are the creeper. Okay. Let me eat something quickly. I gotta get some... I gotta get some coal. Um, get some of these. Make a quick set of torches. And then I probably want to kinda block this here off. And then make a nice way down here. Then I can... Where did my torches go? There. Take some more torches back. Where did... Where did my... My victims go? They were just there. Where did they go? Come on, I need you. Oh, is there some diamond or something around the corner? Nope. No diamonds, no interest. Let me pick up some of that iron again. So, pick up more of the iron. All the other materials are kinda not really worth it for us. We're not planning to do a lot of tech modding and we're going to have a minor. Yeah, but I want a lot of rotten flesh for all kinds of future buildings. So I kind of wanted some decent quantities. These baby creepers are just as creepy as they are. Yes, kill each other. That's much more fun for me. That is. Oh, diamonds. What? Ah, yeah. Just wanted to complain. That was not a lot of diamonds. <laughs> so, who survived? We got a creeper statue. Sweet. I got a zombie. More zombie flesh. And more zombie flesh. Oh, and more diamonds. Nice. <laughs> One of the ugly statues. That's unfortunate. Oh wow, with a sword. That one must be dealing some nasty damage then. Oh, a spider. The spider eyes. We were collecting those spider eyes too. You remember guys? We do need that for our research. So. Oh, two. That's where the two went then. And more. Sixteen. So we're getting quite, quite set up slowly. Oh, there's more. Oh, way more. I think I should probably flood a little bit over here as well. So that their flesh doesn't go wasted. Nice, that's a, that's a nice present. 
That was like zombie to go. And directly around the corner some diamonds to go to. I agree. I like that. Okay, that was that was a nice that was a nice surprise there around the corner. We do need more more torches again. 19, that's okay. For starters. Let's see if there's anything more around here still. Placing some torches down. Going up here a little bit. Just covering more of this underground world. And one of the things I am really... The cave update is going to make all of this, I, th I hope, a little bit more interesting. Because at the moment those caves are as uninteresting as it gets. We already were here, I guess. Uh, what can I drop for this, the diorite? Yeah, I agree. Cave update is one of the few things. There are a bunch of nice cave mods, but there, if it turns out like in a video, I'm going to be happy. If it doesn't turn out like in a video, I'm going to be very ranty for a long period of time. <laughs> I don't forsake Mojang for stupid decisions. They already make enough stupid decisions. At least get this one wrong, come on. At least get this one right, I mean, sorry. Don't want to jinx it. Um, choo -choo -choo, choo -choo -choo. What can I drop of this? Slime drops? What are, what are they for? What can I use that for? Mob drops. It's one of the, what what can I craft with this? Awesome, that sounds good. Um, oh, one of these, one of these pearls is. Oh, nice! I love it. <laughs> I absolutely love it. This was nice. That was a good surprise. Now we got also the slime we needed earlier. I got another zombie wandering around here. Heavily armed one that is. We even got a gold sword. Can I pick up? What kind of sword is this? Refined glowstone sword. Nine attack damage. It's quite the one. 1.6 attack speed. Much better. This is better than my sword. Oh wait, flint I don't need. Cobblestone is fine. That zombie had a better sword than I had. That is a little bit surprising, I would say. Okay, let's dump some of our stuff again here. All the iron ore. The additional iron ingots we just found. And then our... Let's put this here. Oh, we had some more leather here. And then all the stuff in our stuff chest. Some of the diamonds, some of these, all of these additional ones. Um, nine attack damage. Can we repair that? No, it's not recognized here. I needed eight for the research. Yeah, well, I wanted mainly to start with two 
to get the wait to get the next of these here the next resource scroll to so got two so that's on the one delivery man and that's then on the other one and hi shy <laughs> how are you doing you found me <laughs> hmm. I was only saying good things so we got those two the other 90, 59 of this is under delivery. Okay. <laughs> Doing great as well. Life's been busy as hell recently. Being able to get some playtime at night and then using it for streaming mostly. But I'm making, I'm making progress on all fronts, so... I really can't can't complain at the moment. I really do like to complain when things are the only thing that bothers me in my life is if things are not progressing. Those are things that then really bother bother me. Um four signs and a bunch of fence gates. bunch of fence gates that was not what I expected okay much more fence to drop those off directly ah yes you t you uh, you told me on uh, on discord already it sounded great Okay, some more oak. I think the trees there, some of them grew. I imagine, I imagine. So. And I'm going to get the oak here. I'm finally doing great progress with my university research as well. It was kind of like in a semi-stuck phase uh, in theoretical math stuff. But I got most of my stuff now proven to be working fine and got a prototype running. Yes, the creeper seat definitely makes it easier. If you do need any, do you have all the other stuff for it? Like Inferium Essence and this kind of stuff? Can I make two by two oak trees? Okay, let me try to get a more a few more seeds. Let's try that out. You said I can do that. So here. Okay, let's make them two by two and see if that makes it all a little bit faster. Okay, dump that um the redstone as well. So this one here is only missing the strip lots. And that is a task assigned to me. So let's go to the lumberjack, get some general oak, maybe, and get all the strip lots, definitely. Um, wasn't there strip lots, apparently? Uh, only five, okay. Those are only the five. So I'm going to get 20 here. Um, can fill in the logs. Seven fence gates. Get, a, get him at least the fence gates. Um, seven of it. Fair enough. Oh, I'm definitely going to check that out in a second. That's 10. We do a TPA. Let's see what she what she mine colony is prepared 
repaired in her economy. She used my economy sort of. And <laughs> Is, it, is that a mind colony schematic, is it? <laughs> yeah. Looks a little bit like the medieval style. <laughs> I'm definitely going to use create for a few of these things. After having like a farm at level 5, to have a few things rotating. Some level 5 buildings. Yeah, it, it looks like the medieval style, definitely. Yeah, she's in a mushroom biome here. And enjoying the peacefulness. Ah, yes, sure. Show me. I got a, all those. I do not have fall damage protection. Even dragons running around. Do I need fall damage protection? I have water. Is water fine? Okay. Ender stuff. Ah, nice. I threw it. Okay. Oh wow, that's a large dungeon. You're clearing out the entire area here. Ah, you're going to make an, a dungeon dungeon here. Oh, nice. You And you said you're going to dig through bedrock as well. Let me just... Dumb. And she digged through bedrock so we do not want to jump down there yeah I better av avoid that <laughs> nice room light but how do you dig through bedrock that's the question you said there's a vanilla way to uh, dig through bedrock Can show me. So, oh, I have to take the creative way to get out of here. Made it. That's definitely quite the big area around here. What is this? Ah, those are some. Aren't those these pillager? thingy enemies here got some pillagers as well I guess they're going to be part of the dungeon here and are they going to be the inhabitants I guess so <laughs> okay so you said there's a way to break through bedrock with vanilla So use obsidian and place TNT around stuff and trap doors. What is that? A redstone block? I really see it from here. It looks complicated though. Okay, then use lie down under this. <laughs> this this definitely does look complicated. And then there's a chance to mine the bedrock block. <laughs> that definitely likes a play looks like definitely looks like a complicated way to achieve it. I I really wonder who you spam plays a piston and that destroys the the bedrock 
or does that pull the bedrock? Ah, uh, somehow a bedrock. I, I really wonder who comes up with these kinds of ideas and finds out that these kinds of things work. I always wonder how long do these people spend experimenting on random stuff around to find something out like this. Um, either way, it's getting pretty late and I still have to take a shower before going to bed. Thanks everyone for tuning in. Uh, thanks for all the new followers we got. Quite the amount today. Um, I'm going to be online tomorrow again as always. So don't for forget to tune, tune in tomorrow. Um, thanks for engaging in the chat as always with me. And thanks for tuning in. If you want to support the Mind Colonies project. Um, a follow is an easy way and that doesn't cost anything and subscribing as well as becoming a Patreon is highly appreciated. Um, good night everyone. See you tomorrow. Ciao ciao.